Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 4636 in Candy Crush Saga. And if you find these videos helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. So here we've got 23 moves to do a lot of different things. We've got to clear out jelly, clear out crystal candies, and clear out time bombs. Normally I would say, well, you know, let's try to focus on one or the other, but this is the big thing. If I can do this, presumably I have done this, but it doesn't mean I'm taking care of these before 15 turns expire. And if 15 turns expire and I don't take care of them, then I expire. So we have to do something about that. Generally, I want to make moves low to the ground to encourage cascading like this stripe, but if they're going to present me with wrapped candy here or here, I think I have to go with that. I feel compelled to do this. Oh, look at this. Not only do we get more time bombs, but we also get licorice coming down. That's going to be tough because I can't take licorice out right now. I have no licorice to remove. So we're going to be getting that. So let's see. If I do this, and I move that red out of the way, and I've got an orange here, and then I do this, is there any way I'm going to put that striped and wrapped together? I just don't see it. I see it more likely to happen in the central area here. Look at that licorice. Oh my goodness. I think I'm going to go ahead and do this move that I had seen. Now things blew up and that's awesome because look what happens. We're expanding our area of the board so we can make things like color bombs. It's not perfect. Uh, one of the problems is I've got five colors on the board. I have red and because of that it's going to be tough to make combos. But I still can do stuff like this. And then, oh, look at this. I've got a combo. Now, what I would like to do is take out licorice and hope this still exists after I do that. Because if I do this licorice removal, then no new licorice can come down and it doesn't get in the way. Does it take out the licorice if I do that? Okay, so this is totally clear. Now I am going to allow the stripes to hit as much as I can. Okay, so now I have to think about this. I don't have any crystal candies to worry about. I only have to collect two of these. So now I know I don't really have to worry about these. I only have to worry about them as they appear on the board and threaten me. And so far, nothing's a huge threat. Most of these are set at 15. I only have 14 moves. I can take these out easily with these stripes, with the striped wrapped. So now I have to look at all of the different parts of the board. It may be hard to try to get to the top because the licorice is going to keep presenting problems. So I think I'm going to go for that. Uh, take that guy out. Look at that. That's that licorice that's going to be problematic. Let me take this out over here. These are dangerous. I know. I see that. Making this wrapped and having the wrapped explode when I do this is not going to contribute. Taking out the licorice will. So now I have to do something about this. I'm going to go for the big guns. I'm going to go for the striped wrapped combo. Look at how beautiful that is. Better if it were a stripe with that, but I can't really complain too much, can I? Um, but the problem is the things I need to get rid of are up high and these are down low. So I think I'm actually going to take a different tack. Instead of combining this, I'm going to take out all blue. I'm going to go for the stuff that's double thick and hardest to reach, the one that's way high up there. And I'm going to focus on what I can get to kind of naturally here. I can make a raft, but it would situate itself way far down. Wouldn't it be better if I took the raft that I already have and moved it over into this general vicinity? I think it would be better. I could do a stripe, but that's not going to fall the way I need it to. Um, a little stuck. I'm going to do this. Oh, here we go. Now I've got this. That didn't help much, but I have to hope that I can get something here. I need purple over there, and I can't get it. I, even if I get the stripe together, that's not going to work. I could do something very explosive. I could do a stripe, which would set off a whole bunch of different things. I could do a wrapped over here, which would take this out, maybe make some more space. 
I might not make it this time. I'm going to do what I think is going to be the most explosive. Create as much chaos on the board as possible. Look at that. I was still stuck with that purple there and nothing to contribute. But I, I think... Oh, man. If I can adjust the red down and then move this red into place, but I can't the way it is. Oh, wait, hold on. I can move this orange over, and then I think, there we go. I think I can put that together. That was a close one, but we got it done. That's it for me. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to put those below. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.